Hey guys, in this lecture, I'm going to teach you how we can integrate the SMS notifications into your WooCommerce powered WordPress website so that when someone place an order on your website, they will get a SMS directly onto their mobile phone. And trust me, SMS notification really helps you to boost e-commerce sales as this feature generate trust about your business in customers mind. Hence, they come back to your website again and again to buy the products. So let's get started. There are just two simple steps to integrate SMS notifications into your WooCommerce website. Number one, just like you recharge your mobile phone to send SMS to your friends, colleagues, etc. In the same way, you need to sign up with a SMS gateway provider and get credits from them to send SMS notifications to your customers. Number two, to integrate the SMS gateway into your e-commerce website, we need to get a SMS plugin that can help you to synchronize data between SMS service provider and your website. So firstly, let's go ahead and we get the SMS plugin. So this is the WooCommerce website where we are going to integrate the SMS notification. So let's go ahead and we can open a website wpscratch.com from where we can get the SMS plugin. Now in the search box, we need to type text local. That's all one word. It automatically search over here in case if this takes time in loading and loading, then just hit enter. And this is the plugin that we are going to integrate into our website. It just costs $12. So just go to add to cart and then buy this plugin and this plugin can be used on multiple websites. So don't worry like uh, it is not limited for just one website. You can use it on n number of websites. I have already bought this plugin so I'm not going to buy it right now. Now let's go ahead and we can install this plugin into our WooCommerce website. So this is my backend panel. Now we can go to the upload plugin. Choose file and we can upload that plugin into our website. Now after activating this plugin, here we can see a new option SMS notifications. So just hover on it and then click on SMS notifications. Okay, now this asks you for the API key. So it's time to get the API key. Again, we need to simply go on to the new tab and then open a website that is textlocal.com. So this is the global website of TextLocal that is basically a SMS provider company and the service is really great. Now as I am from India, so I can select India. So you can choose the option as per your location. So let's click on India. Now they open the website textlocal.in. I think that is the Indian version of their website. Now we just need to click on this sign up and then we can create a new account which is 100% free of cost and they provide 10 test SMS credits. So we can directly test it onto our website. So here you can enter your email address and then just click on create a free account. All right, so they have sent me a verification email. Just open your inbox and then you need to click on the verification link. So here I have got an email from them. Let's click on this activate. Here we go. So we can see this is the dashboard of our text local account. Now we need to provide our name, company name, rest of the details. So you can just go ahead and just fill up all these details like You can provide the address over here. Okay, time zone is fine or you can change it as per your location. Now here you need to enter your mobile phone number so that they will send a verification code in order to verify your mobile phone. This is just to stop the spamming. So let's type a phone number over here. All right, send verification code and I need to check my phone. So this is what I have received one time password for activating your text local account. Make sure it is case sensitive. All right, now here we can create a password, then check this checkbox and then activate my account. All right, now just close this pop up. It is really not needed. Now go to the settings and here you can find API keys. Just click on it. Now at the very top, we can see 10 credits are available just for testing purpose. So here we need to click on create new key. Now let's scroll down, keep both of these boxes empty, don't put anything over there and then click on save new key. Alright, so this is the API key, just copy it from here. And now go back to your WordPress dashboard and here we need to paste that API key. So let's paste it over here. Okay, now once you enter the API key, just scroll down and click on save changes. 
Now we can see here the sender ID is activated. So you don't need to do anything with that. Make sure do not enable these checkboxes otherwise the notifications will be disabled. In this box you can provide your primary admin number so that could be your mobile phone number. Now make sure to include your country code just before your mobile phone number like as I'm from India so I have inserted plus 91. So if you are from United States you can simply insert plus 1. Now let's scroll down. Now here we need to select on what actions the SMS notification will be sent to. So I suggest you to select processing and completed. So when someone place an order then he will receive a SMS notification as well as once you complete the order then the SMS notification will be sent to. Now here we have certain boxes where we can provide the custom messages. So this box is for the orders which are under hold status. Here we have complete status box in processing. Now just below it you can see these variables. So if you insert these variables in this box it will automatically fetch the order number or the customer details from the billing form as well as from the WooCommerce database. So let's say we can type here hello and then we have billing first name. This is the variable just copy it from here and paste it in this box. So that will automatically fetch the customer name from the billing form. Comma. Thanks for shopping with us. your order number and then we have the order number variable has been completed. Good luck. Make sure it only supports 160 characters so do not make long messages over here. Now let's copy it from here and we can paste it inside this processing box and here we can type something like thanks for shopping with us your order number is under process. Okay now let's scroll down. Leave all these four boxes empty and then click on save changes. So that's all you have to do in setting up the SMS plugin into your WordPress website. Now it's time to test the SMS notifications on our phone. So I have a demo website. Now let's place order of this product and we can click on add to cart, view cart. Now this is the checkout page where I have already filled all my details and that is my phone number. I mean the mobile phone number. Now let's click on place order. Okay. Now I'm going to show you onto my mobile phone whether I have received the message or not. So here we can see onto my mobile screen that is the TLTEST and this is what I have received. Hello Saddam. Thanks for shopping with us. Your order number 476 is under process. And here also we can see on the screen that is the order number 476 and the name I have entered as a customer was Saddam. You can see the first name has been fetched. So this is how you can integrate the SMS notifications into your WooCommerce website. If you like this video, please do not forget to subscribe my channel, like the video and leave your positive comment. Thank you very much.